Take him as the successor because every prophet, 124,000 prophets, they all had successors. Moses, Jesus, Jesus' successor was Simon. Moses' successor was Harun. Suleiman had the successor Asif, the one that brought the thing. So Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, his successor is Ali alayhi salam. And if you don't take him because in the grave they're going to ask you, who's your imam? And you have to answer Ali because when Imam Ali buried his mom, he said to his mom while she was in the grave. What about the narration about them asking about who's your prophet? Yeah, who's your prophet as well? Of yeah, course, yeah. that's first. Yeah. But when his mom, Imam Ali, buried his mom, Fatima bint Asad, while she was in the grave, he said, Mother, if the angel of death asks you who is your imam, say, My son is my imam, Imam Ali. You know, when it comes to Ali, radiallahu anhu, yes. we love him. MashaAllah. Listen, listen, no, no, I'll tell you why this is important. Yeah. We love him, we revere him, we should talk more about him. And I don't like the fact that sometimes when those topics come up, controversial discussions about Shi and Sunni and yeah. all that sort of no, stuff I come I up. Don't. I know, I know, I know. But what I'm saying is, it needs to be said. It doesn't get said enough. Abu Bakr radiallahu an, Umar radiallahu an, Uthman radiallahu an, Ali radiallahu an. Can I say something? First of all, yeah. No. We say Karam Allah yeah. Wajah because Ali alayhi salam, he never bowed down to an idol. So the Sunnah, they say Karam Allah Wajah because he's the only one that never bowed down to an idol. Do you understand? Abu Bakr bowed down, bow down to Before idol. Islam, yes. And Umar as well because they became Muslim after. But Imam Ali is the only one that never is bowed down to an idol. Is there evidence of them bowing Yeah, yeah, in all the books. In all the books. Can you give me a story? They were not Muslim and then they became Muslim. Yeah, but in terms of them bowing down to idols, you can find that evidence. Oh, because they were, um, there's one uh, narration, I can bring it to you in Sahih al-Bukhari. Yeah, bring it. Yeah, bring it. Yeah. Uh, I but until then, yeah. um, do you see that, unfortunately and sadly, some people go into the Shia Sunni thing? No, no. I'm against, bro. When Imam Mahdi yeah. comes out, yeah. 70,000 Shia from Iraq, so-called Shia, are going to fight Imam al-Mahdi. Yes. 70,000 Shia, Shia are going to fight Imam Mahdi themselves. Yeah. Scholars with the turbans from uh, Nejaf, Kufa, the back of Kufa, Nejaf, they're going to say, Go back, O son of Fatima, we don't need you. And my Mahdi will take out the sword and 70,000 of them. And they're, they're, they're here today. They're called the battery, the batteries. Batteries? They're called batteries. Not, okay. uh, not battery as in Jerusalem battery, but battery. Not battery, battery. Bet battery, no, okay. battery, but with the E, battery. Okay. That's what they're called in the, the book Al Kafi, it calls them Al Batteria. Okay. So, as a brother, when Shaitan, he worshipped Allah for 6,000 years in sujood, just sujood 6,000 years. Allah said to him, bow down to Adam. He said, I'm not bowing down to a man. I only bow down to Allah. Let, let, me, let me tell you something. Let but, me tell you something. Let me tell you something. It's the same thing with Ahlul Bayt. When it, when it comes to Shia and Sunni debate. No, I don't care about Shia and Sunni. I know, I know, I know. I Shia, they're the one, first people to go against me. I call myself from the Sunnah of the Prophet Muhammad. I love the Sunnah and I hate the Bid'ah and I hate the people of Bid'ah. And the people of Bid'ah, my job on this earth is to beef them, to shook them up, and to trouble them and to scare them. No, just no, no. Just give that word to them. Uh, no, just speak to them. Just speak to them. Oh, uh, you hold. Oh, yeah. I'm saying the people of Bid'ah are our enemies. We have to revive the Sunnah and kill the Bid'ah. So. Anyone who does bid'ah, we have to screw his face. We don't smile in his face. There's a hadith that says, if you smile in a person who's a Nasabi's face, the one who has hatred to Prophet Muhammad and Ahl Bayt, 40 years your salah is not accepted. I'm just saying, but another sheikh said 40 days. So if I'm here and I know, and I know something, why is the verse saying in the Quran, Alladheena yabalaghuna risalat Allah wa yakhshawnuhu Those that deliver the message of Allah and fear Allah Wa la yakhshawna ahadan illa Allah I think it's important bro, yeah. for you to also acknowledge as well and understand yeah. That there's enough verses, yeah. there's enough hadith, a hadith in fact yeah. That tell us that the successor, the, the one that came after the Prophet peace be upon him Was Abu Bakr Okay, uh, first of all let me answer that Then Umar Okay, I'm with you, I'm with you, I'm with you then, right. then However, I just wanted to say one thing I've, I've acknowledged what you said. The word, the word peace be upon him, I don't like it. I like blessings be upon him because the word peace can sound like something else. I just I wanted to say that. So in the future, please stop saying peace. Say, Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi. Instead of saying peace be upon him, 
either say blessings what, what, be upon him. What does peace sound like? You know what it sounds like, I'm not going to tell you. You're smart enough to know, because you're a very smart guy. Yeah, I'm a smart guy, yeah. but you, sometimes use your head. Use your head. What does peace stand like? sound like, bro? Peace? Yeah, what does it sound like? Are you talking about in the English language? Yes, or in language? the English language, because it's English. Like pieces? No! Oh, I'm not going to say it, bro. Okay, no problem. The, the viewers will tell you. Okay, Listen, okay. so either say, Sallallahu Alaihi Wa in Arabic, or say, blessings be upon him. With regards to what you said... What about if we're speaking to a non-Muslim? No, Muslims say, blessings be upon him and his family. Because what about his companions? Yes, yeah, yeah. the companions, of course, the ones that we, we love them as well. We love yeah. the companions, the ones that were with him and died with him. Ammar ibn Yasir, his mom was the first shaheed in Islam. Abu Jahl, Abu Jahl, he stuck the spear inside her private part. What about, what about Abu Bakr? Sumayya, wait one second. Yeah. Sumayya, the mom of uh, Ammar ibn Yasir, he was the greatest companion, Ammar ibn Yasir. His mother was the first shaheed. No one talks about that. Abu Jahl, what did he say to Ammar? He said, when he saw that happen to his mom, they said, who's your Lord? Ammar said, Hubbal is my Lord. Why? Because he done taqiyya. And then the verse came down, then he came to the Prophet, he said, oh, I, I said, Hubbal is my Lord, did I do wrong? The Prophet said, if they ask you again, say it again. Because the verse came down, those that have Iman in their heart, then is, that's the most important. He done taqiyya and that, so he doesn't get killed. So he stayed and he was the greatest what, Sahaba. But what about the second of the two in the cave? Okay, regarding the cave, as a brother, I love you and I, I'm with you. I follow the Sunnah and I'm against the people of Bid'ah. But I just want to say, regarding the cave, first of all, it says, La Tahzan. The Prophet told the, Abu Bakr, do not be sad. In this situation, the scholars have said he, sh he shouldn't be sad. Because when the Prophet says, don't do something, this is an order from Allah. It means don't do it, it's wrong. So when he said to him, don't be sad, he's telling him, stop being sad. It's, you're wrong what you're doing. That's number one. Number two, Abu Bakr in the cave should have been scared, not sad. Khaif, because they're coming to kill them, to kill the Prophet. That's number two. Number three. Was, was Abu Bakr with the Prophet in the cave? Yes. Did he, help, did he help I'm him in the journey? You, but I'm asking you no, what the no. scholars have said. I understand. Because understand. you've got your opinion, the scholars have yeah, got yeah. another opinion. You understand? But, but it just seems like, look, so I believe, yeah. and we believe, and you, because you're upon the Sunnah, you're upon Shah, the Haq, of course, of course. as well. Yeah. So you believe that after the Prophet, peace be upon him, Abu Bakr, Why you, yeah, yeah. instead of saying peace be upon him, say sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. No, for the Prophet. Oh, I'm just used to speaking to no, no say Muslim. even with the non-Muslim, say sallallahu alayhi wa It's No better. problem, no right. problem. Yeah. So then Abu Bakr radiallahu an was there. Yeah. When even the people that were close to him yeah. didn't accept him, the Prophet, peace be upon him, gave him shade. Right. Helped him. Can I tell you know what, the, what the scholars say and the then, truth? Wait, wait, let yeah. me let me make the point. Then Umar radiallahu an came because of him, Islam became strengthened. Can I ask yeah? you? Yeah. Then Uthman radiallahu an can I ask he you? came. Can I ask you? Yeah. They say if there were two Umars, all right. Islam, let me ask you. Let me ask you for everything wait, wait, you're saying. Let, let, let I understand you love Umar. I understand that. No. My I'm, dad's family in Iraq, they I, love Umar. I they're want, Sunnah. My dad. I want to know, do my you, great great my. Dad, you, my dad's you. family, they're, they're Sunnah scholars but in do Iraq. You though, do you? I'm saying my dad's family are Sunnah I'm scholars in Iraq. Dad. But me, do I you. told my dad's family, they're all Sunnah scholars yeah. in Iraq, they're big Sunni family. I said to them, listen, the truth is the truth. I'm with Ali yeah. and the Haq is with Ali and whoever goes Ali against Ali, I have to go against him. I told them that. So you go against and Abu Bakr? No, let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Answer my question. Fatima is Zahra, the daughter of the Prophet Muhammad. Yeah. In Sahih Bukhari and all the books, Look, look, look. I'm going to say we I'm with Fatima. Into, we can get okay, who this. do you love more, Fatima or Abu Bakr? Look, all of them. Who do them. you love more, Fatima the Zahra, the daughter of the Prophet Muhammad, or Abu Bakr? All of, all, of all of them. All of them? All of them. No, no, who do you love more? All of them. Why do I need to pick? Why do I need to pick? I'm going to say all of them. Which one do you love more? We don't need to pick. Why is there a choice? Because the Prophet Muhammad said, Fatima is a part of me. Whoever hurts her has hurt me. Whoever hurts me has hurt Allah. So does and that mean that I need to now pick? Of course you have to pick. How did you use that to tell me that I need to pick between Abu Bakr and Fatima? When the, when, I thought you were upon the Sunnah. When the, when the Fatima is Zahra. I thought you were against Bid'ah. No, Fatima. This I'm question is a Bid'ah. No, it's not Bid'ah. Fat Bid'ah Kabir. Okay. Fatima is Zahra. Ask the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Who do you love more? Me or Ali? Who is greater? Me or Ali? So even... Who is she asking? She asked her father, the Prophet Muhammad. Yeah. And he answered her. But is her. this... 
a part of our faith that yes. we need to because, because, ask each other because these you will questions. be you will be with those who you love al mar'u ma'a man ahab yeah so i'm going to be with abu bakr umar usman ali fatima okay. jafar sadiq abu hanifa all of them inshallah will you be with all of them no i'm not going to be with all of them you are not from ahl sunnah no, let Jabbar. me explain let me explain no. The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi, he said in all the books, I leave with you two things, Kitab Allah and my Ahlul Bayt. Only Malik, only Malik changed it and he said Kitab Allah wa Sunnati, only Malik. This, the rest of the scholars, no, no, no. one second, if anyone proves this, me wrong, Wallahi, if anyone proves me wrong, I will give 10,000 pounds, listen, I will pay 10,000 pounds to anyone who proves me wrong. The only person that said, Quran and the Sunnah is Malik. The rest said Quran and Ahlul Bayt. Len no, But you, you also said they made it up. If yeah. you don't want to be. You said he made it up, yeah? Who made it up? Malik, Malik, Malik yeah. Yeah? Yeah, he, he made, made it, up. it up. He said Quran okay, and the Okay, okay. But wait, let me explain. No, 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 no. Because look, you, how, he, how much changed, money are you going to give me? He how changed much money? it. He changed it. How much money? It. You he said 10,000. He changed the thing. I get 10,000 pounds. Cash. Okay. I want it in 50s. In 50s? Yeah, I'll yeah. go HSBC, I'll yeah. make it. Yeah, go, go and get it now. <laughs> okay, I'll, let me make a phone call, I'll get it ready Make it happen, bro. I'll get it ready for you, Bring bro. the case. You get that, you sort that out. Bring that case, easy. I'm not, I'm a man of my word. People know me, I've been on the internet. Yeah, if get I on the call, get on the call. I'm not going to give them 10,000. That's it. Cool. What, what, is just, the, what is the challenge? You, you stop the call. Wait, one second. The, the challenge is, <laughs> the hadith was Quran and Ahlul Bayt. He's saying no. Sorry, sorry. Oh. He said Quran and the Sunnah. Sorry, brother. What's this? <laughs> World War Three. Traffic will be blown. Everybody will fall and touch his attacks. Okay, this guy, I just want to say something about this guy. This guy has got some truth in what he's saying. World War Three is coming. And the, the reason why I'm saying this is because an American general has said... No, but he believes he's a Mahdi. No, no, though. one second. He, no, no, he's not the Mahdi. He's just a miskin. Look. <laughs> The American general said in 2025, we're going to war with China. One of the major signs of the return of the Mahdi is that there will be a world war, the, 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 the Red Death, and there will be a plague as well. These, these are American rational goods, world competitions. Make sure right. that he makes a call. So basically, hmm? what sure he's, he makes saying, call. he's saying, maybe Allah sent him, what he's trying to say is going to be nuclear warfare. A lot of places are going to get crushed. However, in the hadith, it said the Middle East will be safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to make the call now in front of everyone. Ten, Go on, bro. 10,000 pounds. Ten thousand pounds in 50s. can destroy everybody on earth 341 times. 341,000, wow. mashallah. No, yeah. 341 Mashallah. Times. Uncle's raised the stakes. 341 the call, times they can destroy the world. Bro. I am persuading Mary and Russia, stop blowing up the world. Alright, uh, listen, I'm just making a call for this £10,000 transaction. 50s, yeah. Yeah, 50s. Can you put it on loudspeaker? <laughs> listen, and <laughs> what, 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 do you, okay, I just, while we're making a phone call, yeah. I just wanted to say to you, as a brother who has good manners, like you, and a brother who is soft, because the believer is soft, the hadith says, the believer is so soft that people mistake him for being crazy. Majnoon. Would you say you're soft? I'm soft, but at the same time, I'm, I'm tough, because Allah has, before the creation of this world, Allah told the believers jump into hell. So the believers jumped in. Those that came out of hell were listened to Allah. They, they had something called hidda in Islam means power, anger. So you're soft and hard. Yeah. Uh, so the, the kafir, <laughs> when Allah told the kafir before he created the, the humans, the earth, he said to the kafir, jump in hellfire. The kafir didn't listen. So the kafir is cold. He doesn't get angry. He doesn't have ghira. He's like a pig. Do you understand? He's so, he's Why isn't he picking up? I, I swear to you, I'm trying. You, you know he's ringing. So the believer, what does Musa, when he asked Allah, who will you put, be putting in the highest heavens in the next life? He said that those people that are get angry for my sake, for my sake, like the tiger when ah. he's injured. Okay, that's a good point. The that's tiger a, when no, no, he's no. injured. The brother makes yeah? a good point because what he actually means is in the Quran, it says, Radiallahu anhum wa radu an. I am pleased with them, i.e. the Sahaba, and they are pleased with me. Indeed. Yeah, so for us, it's very important that we love the companions. Of course, the people of yeah? Badr, the people of Badr. Abu Bakr, radiallahu an. Umar, radiallahu an. Uthman, radiallahu an. And Ali, radiallahu an. And Fatima, radiallahu an. Alayhi salam, alayhi salam, because Ali, alayhi salam. What happened to the call? Because he didn't answer. Make it again. I'm going to make it again. So basically, the name Al-Farooq was originally for Imam Ali. Wallahi, 
they gave it to Umar. The, the name as Sadiq, Wallahi, was for Imam Ali, they gave it to Umar. Wallahi, I see you as my brother. The then, Sadiq then, is Ali. Then, then he's we'll the speak, Sadiq and we'll he's the Faro. With evidences, not claims. From the, the Prophet called him. No, no, no. There we'll, is no man. Uh, he's picked up. He picked there up. Yo, no yo, listen. There's wait, no wait, 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 one second, one second. Uh, get ten thousand uh, pound ready because in fifties. This guy is saying about uh, some hadith that he can, uh, the hadith about my family and Ahlul Bayt. He's saying it's my family and the Sun. Uh, just tell him to get the money. Bro. Just get the money. <laughs> Forget it. Just get the ten thousand pound ready. I'm going to call you back in ten minutes. Is right. Don't tell him where to bring it, bro. No, he's going to get it ready. Don't worry. No, but he doesn't know where you are. Is it, no, he's going to watch. <laughs> How? Just listen to me. Wait, wait, wait. You told him get the ten thousand pound ready for what though? He's gonna That's half the oh job. God. What, you Tell him, been... my main man Zishan's hair speaker's corner. Yeah. Bring it in fifties in ten minutes. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi rajiun. Bro, this guy. Bro, you're not gonna get it, bro. I swear to God. I'm not gonna get the money. Yeah, because you ain't got the thing. He's not answering. No, but I'm not gonna get the money if you don't bring the yeah, money. Yeah, no. If you don't bring the hadith. <laughs> okay. Bring now let me just say, tell you one thing. Regarding. He just hung up again, no, bro. No, because he he blocked off. <laughs> Listen. Regarding, regarding, yeah, regarding. Yes. Oh, no, 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 it's my pleasure. It's, 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 it's come. Basically, reg what? Listen, regarding this brother, like I said, yeah, he loves Ahl al Bayt, but at the same time, if you love the enemies of Ahl al Bayt, you'll be rejected by Ahl al Bayt. They will not love you back. But I don't think they're the enemies. That's no, no. Like I said, some people, I'm not saying who, yeah. were enemies of Ahl al Bayt. Yeah. And the reason that that there is chaos today in the world is because after the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa died, they didn't listen to the Prophet's commandments about following Ali. That's why Islam is in shambles. That's why anything, anything that our brother has said here has been without evidence. Okay. Yeah. These are claims. Wallahi, even, I'll bring that evidence. even even the call that's being made about the ten thousand no, showmanship. It's it's the fourth time he's making it. He'll make it. Like, then he'll hang up bro. again. He'll Tell speak him. to this guy. Like, then he'll make it again. Allah. Look, we can Ali, have these discussions, Ali did not want to but there's no evidences here. No, no. Ali wanted to become a but, community but, leader. Yeah. Yeah. Community no, no. What I'm trying to say is, for the sake of the ummah. You have to do it today. The, look, look, for the sake of the Ummah, I would never, you need I'm not to. You need, to look, 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 you need to love the Prophet. You need to love the Sahaba, including yeah. Abu Bakr, Umar, Uthman, and Ali. You yes. need to love the Ahl Bayt with a holistic approach. Okay. You don't say that the Prophet, peace be upon him, students left him straight after no, he no, passed no, away. No, yeah. We don't say that the no, verse no, in the Quran that says, Radiallahu an wa radu an. Now we, we reject that verse. And now the Pro Prophet's companions left him, but we need to follow him. This, look, there's, there's too much. No, no. The, the, I understand what you're yeah, saying. There's too I much inconsistencies with this, the narrative. I understand, I understand you are defending the Sunnah and the Sahaba. And I defend the Bayt as well. Yeah, the Ahlul Bayt is Ali, Fatima, Hassan, Hussein, I'm defending and, and them the Prophet as well. Muhammad. It's yeah. five people, okay? The Ahlul Bayt, Ali, Muslim. No, but also the wives of the Prophet, be no, the, the Ahlul Bayt. The, as well. the wives of the Prophet, we put them on our head, we love them, they are our mothers, but they are, not Thank you, bro. they are not considered, they are from the Ahlul Bayt, as in, as in wives, yes, but yes. they are not considered the Ahlul Bayt. The reason is because the five Ahlul Bayt, according to the Sunnah... According to whose definition though? Um, most of the Sunnah. Uh, you can hang your head. What do you mean most of the Sunnah? Brother, this is first. Most of the Sunnah have said Ali, Fatima, Hassan, Hussein. Because the wife... Where am I getting my money? The, yeah, he's calling up. He's not. Hadar, Hadar. The wife can be divorced and she goes back to her family. So, example, if you marry someone and you divorce them, they go back to their family. You marry, she doesn't become a Guys, nice. look. The, you the, understand? The point, if she got divorced... Look, the point here like, is clear. Yeah, he put up the 10,000 pounds. I'm never going to see the 10,000 pounds. Well, you see it. If you bring the hadith, you're going to see it. Okay, now That's the money. conditions have changed. Now I need to bring the hadith for me to see the money. But he called the person saying, come with the money in no, 10 no, minutes. Because I said, all the Muslim scholars But he say, didn't know where to come though. All the Muslim scholars said, I, I leave with you two things, the Quran and my Ahl al-Bayt. Only one Muslim scholar who is Malik, he said Quran and Sunnah. He's the only one that said that. So you know. He's the only so one. So now you've made the claim. Yeah. Now you need to wait for me to refute so, that claim. Yeah, but when I see the money, then I'll be like, this guy's serious. Okay, we're, we're on the phone now. We're sorting it out. But you're supposed to be on the phone. I'm not sorting out. This is my bridges. They're doing it. But what I'm trying to say. I'm not going to see that money. What's I'm more? Money. Look, if you had the whole world right now, yeah? Yeah. In your hands. But you don't have the whole world. But you don't have Ahl al-Bayt, you have nothing. 
No, I, I disagree with that. You know why? I say, I need to have, because what you're saying is you have Ahl al-Bayt, but you haven't mentioned Allah as the Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Of course, you love Allah and the Prophet, oh, and no, then Ahl al-Bayt. But you said if you have nothing, no, no. except Ahl al-Bayt, because, because shaitan, that's worship. Shaitan, when he said, I'm going to bow down to Adam, Allah told him, bow down to Adam. He said, Adam is a man. I only bow down to Allah, just like some people. We only say to Allah, no, Adam is a man. Why should I bow down to him? Allah said, you worship me how I want to be worshipped. Allah said to the people, you worship me by following Ahl al-Bayt after the Prophet. After the Prophet. That's why. So if you don't accept that, then I, it's the same I, worship I, I, as Shaitan. I accept following the Ahl al-Bayt, but I also accept following the Khulafai Rashidin. Okay, that's, that's okay I understand what you're saying about the, 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 I have, 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 I Robbie, you're getting that money. I'm not getting that money. Sorry, my honor, my honor, my honor. 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 Listen, I'm trying to stop the fight. Listen. Is that she a Sunni flex? So. Is it? No, yeah, bro, Saddam that's flex. He's back in Saddam. Is okay, it? they don't like Saddam. Oh, really? Okay. Because Saddam, remember this, Saddam. He, there's, there's a lot of supporters. There's a lot of hate people that hate him. But what I'm trying to say. Let's let's talk when the money gets here. Yeah. Then we have a proper right. conversation. Do you understand? That I you, think you understand. I understand. We've made our yeah. points. Right. We're just going around in circles. No, I'm not going. I'm never going to say. But remember one. Go around thing. in a square. Remember one thing. Square. When the Mahdi returns. Why is he called Al Muntaqal? Bro, when you when you make these points, then I have to counter these points. Okay. It's just going to be long, isn't it? Are bring you waiting case. for right. bring the case? I'm waiting for the case. Okay. Do you believe in Imam Mahdi? Do you believe in the ten thousand pound case? Yes. <laughs> then bring <laughs> it. Where's my phone? Where went to the phone? Yeah, bring it. Right. Make that happen, bro. Imam Al Mahdi. Bro, come on. Bring you know what the, the hadith says? First. The hadith says if the whole the world. The hadith says don't lie. If the hadith says if the whole world was sacrificed for the blood of Imam Hussein, it wouldn't be enough. It wouldn't be enough. Wait, where, was it? where did he say? Wait, I'll where show you. Say? I'll show you one second. He, one second. he doesn't like giving evidences. The angels told Allah, look what they did to Hussein, the grandson of the Prophet. His blood is everywhere. Allah said, don't worry, I will send the Mahdi to take to take my revenge. When no, the Mahdi no returns, references. No when references. the Mahdi returns, no he will come with no mercy. No, no references. The Mahdi will come with no mercy. No references. He will be tough on everyone. Even the, some of the, a lot of the No references. Just believe him. Everyone's gonna get smoked. Trust me, bro. When the Mahdi comes, everyone's gonna get it. Trust me, bro. He's come to take revenge on the enemies of Allah and his prophet and the Ahlul Bayt. Trust me, bro. No Dalil, no proof. Imam Al Mahdi, 500 Sunni hadiths about Imam Al Mahdi. 500. 500. Could be 600, who knows? Imam Al Mahdi is our Imam. That's why we wait for him every day. We, we say, Ya Allah, the Mahdi, we love him. Is our Mahdi is our Imam. Who's your Imam right now? My Imam? Yes. Is the, the one in the, my local masjid. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa Muhammad. He's our Prophet. He's our Messenger. No, no, in my local masjid, he's the Imam. Oh, what? Imam, Imam of the masjid. Oh, you mean the. No, no, no. I'm talking about. Wait, hold on a minute. Your Imam? Yeah, Imam of the Masjid. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Imam of prayer. Wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Imam. Bro, I'm talking about the Imam, bro. Which Imam? <laughs> what? Wait, what is a local, imam? local uh, Imam. Stop talking about local Imam, bro. Bro, what? You mean like, hold on, like, it leaves me in every, Salah? Every Masjid, bro, there's an Imam, there's a leader. This guy, bro, hey, you know what? Hey, you're confusing oh, me, bro. <laughs> well, don't be confused, bro. Just bring me the money. All right, listen, listen, let me tell bring you me one money, Let bro. me tell you one You're confusing yourself. I swear to God, I swear to God. Are you going to bring me the 10,000? I show up. I swear to God, listen to me carefully. The believer has four eyes, two here and two here. Because he oh, is that glasses, Joe? No, no, no. No, no, I'm being serious. <laughs> okay. The believer has a psychic power. There's a hadith from the Prophet. Every where, believer has where? a psychic power. Right. Because he given, he's given by the light of Allah. Right. He, can, he has a special power. Right. So the believer, you can see the light in his eyes. So and the believer will acknowledge the Prophet, the Sahaba, and the Ahl al-Bayt. Okay, let me speak. Let me speak. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's time for Salah. Have you prayed Asr? I need to pray Asr. I've prayed Asr because I joined it. Okay. Yeah, Bahar with Asr. But Salah is the most important thing. And because the Adhan is happening now, I say that you go and pray. Is it done Adhan for Asr? Yes. I say you go and pray. Okay. Because there's nothing more important than Salah. And the reason why Imam Hussein died was to protect Salah. 
That's the reason. So anyone who doesn't pray is worse than a pig. And that's the truth. Because the pig on the day of judgment will say, Alhamdulillah, I was created as a pig and not created as a person who left his salah. <laughs> no, so, trust me, bro. The pig is very... So if you don't pray, you're finished. That's good advice, bro. Appreciate it. I appreciate you, man. And bro, take care of yourself, bro. And inshallah, we're going to have a round two. Because I would love to just debate you. Could do. Just have bring that round. case, bro. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll bring the cash up front. But I love to debate with you. No, no, and take care. Look after yourself, you bro. You too, my yeah? brother. Yeah. Thank you. You're just going to say your one now. You know the older when they ask you who do you love first, Abu Bakr, yeah. Sahaba, you know, or yeah. Fatima, yeah. always standing first. Stand with Abu Bakr. But this is a Muslim general, Abu Bakr, Omar. We love Ahl al Bayt, yes, of course. Sometimes you know what it is? They, they take the clip, they start shopping like that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Look, yeah. these two means they're taking X over Y. Nawasir, of Nawasir, the one you can, you know. So we don't give them anything. Yeah, but you know, like Ahl al Bayt, Ahl al Bayt themselves. They call their kids Abu Bakr and Umar and all that, you know. Yeah, yeah. You can bring them back and say, how can they, how did they help, you know. If you think they're the enemies, because they start to be kind of uh, insinuating that there is a, uh, okay, you love, you love Sahaba, but you love the enemies of Ahl Bayt. And which enemies of Ahl Bayt are you talking about? Because they have some disagreement with some Sahaba, that's not our problem, you know. Yeah, this one. It changed the thumbnail though, because we're both facing the wrong way. It would change the thumbnail. Yeah. Uh, say, say, he's the Maudin Prince to give 10,000 pounds. Yeah. Maudin.